Okay, I'll take the over on the Pittsburgh game. Oh, and P to the S. I never got my payout from Seattle from two weeks ago. Yeah. Don't make me call the gaming commission on you. I'm sure they'd be very interested to know what's going on over there. All right? All right? Okay, I love you too, Mom. Take care. <laughs> Hello, Lily. <laughs> You've somehow managed to circumvent my security. How did you do it? Ted gave me your spare key. Spare key? Brilliant. Look, I'm sorry. You know I'd only come here if I had no other choice. But earlier today, I was getting ready to go to sleep and... See ya. Wait, well, can I stay here, maybe? Oh, uh, I'd let you, but I don't have any room. Well, you live in a two-bedroom apartment. You have one room just for your suits. Hey, I'm at a point in my life where my suits are my family. Look around, you, Lily. You are in the heart of bachelor country. And as a woman, you are an illegal immigrant here. Now, you could try to apply for a sex visa, but that only lasts 12 hours. 14 if you qualify for multiple entry. Huh. Ew, is something some lame judgmental chick would say, but I say give me multiple high fives. Wow, you really are desperate. I really am. Oh, okay, you can stay here for two days. But I only have one rule. You can't change anything. Why would I change anything? This place is... Perfect. Hmm. Except for the fact that you don't have a TV. See that wall? <laughs> 300 inch flat screen. They only sell them in Japan, but I know a guy. I had to ship it over in a tugboat like freaking King Kong. It hurts my eyes. Yeah, that doesn't go away. Mmm, smells delicious. Thank you. There was no food in the fridge, so I picked it. What are you doing? Really? What was the first rule again? Don't change anything. And what was the second rule? There was no second rule. Exactly! Thing. There was only one rule, and you broke it! I bought groceries. That counts as changing something? Uh, Lily, if I wanted a fridge full of groceries or fresh coffee in the morning, I'd be in a relationship. <laughs> But I don't want to be in a relationship. That's why I make it crystal clear to every girl that walks through that door that this is not a place to leave a toothbrush. This is not a place to leave a contact lens case. This is a place to leave. Come on, I'll give you a tour. Uh, no flash photography, please. Bienvenido to the bedroom. Dig this. King-size bed, full-size blanket, one pillow. Everything about this bed says our work here is done. Next, we say bienvenue to the bathroom. What? Only one towel? What? No hair dryer? You know where I keep that stuff? Your place. Beat it. <laughs> and the coup de gras. <laughs> yeah, that's right. Patent pending. <laughs> and we'll go men to the hallway. While guys like Ted and Marshall may hide their porn. Marshall doesn't have porn. Oh, <laughs> that's sweet. Well, guys like Ted and Marshall may hide their porn, I had mine professionally lit. <laughs> Girls see this, they can't get out of here fast enough. And if that doesn't drive them away, there's always your life-size stormtrooper. No, that's just awesome. So you see, whenever a girl wakes up here, I never have to tell her to go build her nest somewhere else. My apartment does it for me. <laughs> <laughs>